Hello everybody and welcome back to Wonder Boy 3 Monster Lair. In the last video we finished up three more bosses and moved on to this level, which is the last level in the game I believe. Uh, and in this video we're going to finish up the game. Uh, hopefully it's been an enjoyable experience, enjo enjoyable experience for you guys. Uh, I really like this game and I thought it was pretty unique and I thought it would be a fun way to, uh, a fun game to make my third let's play of. It shows off, uh, it has a lot of unique things with the pl combining platforming and shooter elements, which I thought was unique. You don't really see that in many games. Um, off the top of my head, I can't really think of any. I'm sure there are more, but... But yeah. And in this level, we have these guys making a return. The guys that shoot the ball when they die. Uh, before, you also saw the teleporting guys. Uh, we have these guys, too. Those guys teleport in, and then they shoot a ball at you, and then they run away. Uh... But other than them, we have the the guys that were just teleporting in before those guys. They teleport in in the line, which covers the whole row you're in. So you have to take them out or else they're going to run right into you and you're dead at that point. Which would not be good. Not good for the health. Uh, those guys you can kill. Those, a lot of times they're really hard to reach, so a lot of times it's not even worth trying to go after them. Some, most of the time, you know, just doing a simple jump. Uh, right there, um, we set off the spring. I'm really glad we didn't jump off though, because if we did, we would have been killed by the wall of monsters that was coming towards us. Um, again, with the variety of enemies there, we have, wow, they had fill up both rows all at once, so there's really no way of avoiding that, avoiding that at all. And right there, luckily, we didn't, wow. I don't know how I jumped over them, uh, it definitely looked like I should have got hit by that top one, but that might have been a pixel perfect jump there that I just pulled off, so, and then I eat my words by getting hit by a guy that was relatively easy to avoid. What are you gonna do though? I've already proven that I'm not the greatest at this game, but at least I'm playing it. And this time we hop into a spaceship instead of walking through the mouth, and now we're in space riding our guy. Which seems very safe. I hope he. I hope neither of us need oxygen to survive because I highly doubt there's a very good amount of oxygen supply up here in space. But maybe there is in Monster World, I don't know. Or whatever this area, the town's called, this planet. I'm just assuming it's Monster World since yeah, um, that's what most of the games are subtitled with. Um, this is a relatively easy space stage until we get to here. This is the dragon. Once we kill him, uh, this is the other two-part boss. Unfortunately, we have to use another continue there. That dragon's fire is really deadly. Uh, it will one-shot you if you don't avoid it. And on top of avoiding the fire, we have to avoid these whirlwinds. Um, we're just going to cheese our way through this and take the deaths so that we can get on to the final boss here. And then in the final boss, he shoots lightning. Uh, I don't know if this lightning has a pattern. A lot of times I just stay really close to him and it won't hit me. But other times, I'm not having such good luck here. It hit me quite a bit. But he's almost dead now. He's glowing red. So, a few more hits and he'll be dead. There we go. I mean, not the most classy way to get through the game, but I guess it works, right? Hopefully you guys won't give me too much flack for that. Get our bonus points here. And we'll watch the ending. Well, I can move around here, we gotta move over here. And then we'll watch the ending. There we go, we got the- I believe that's the legendary armors and weapons that are present in the other games, if you ever played any of those, so... He gets those back. And then we get some pretty cool music. Which is much better than that annoying uh, sound effect that was just happening a moment ago. Talk about ear rape. Alright, so now let's talk about the aliens and how they, when they, they previously made an attempt to conquer the world, uh, how they were unsuccessful because of the legendary weapons. I'm assuming that's the first two games they're, they're referencing there. Uh, so they were defeated by the legendary weapons, and this time they decided they wanted to steal those weapons to use them in attack. Uh, but the weapons weren't using the miraculous power when they were used by the evil guys. 
so we took back the weapons, used them the proper way, and defended the planet from the alien invasion once and for all. I highly doubt it's once and for all since there's at least two more games in the series. We got some good music playing there. Presented by Sega. But anyway, that's gonna bring an end to my uh, my third Let's Play here. I know it was a rather short one, we only got four videos out of it. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed the game, and if you really liked that, I'd suggest you go give it a try yourself. Uh, you'll probably be better than I am at it. Uh, but at least then you'll know how difficult it is, because it might look easier than it really is. Um, on the, as on the screen, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in my next Let's Play, as well as in my other ones if you're watching them. Thanks again, guys.